Hi, my name is Bianca Peixinho. Hello, my name is Karina Sonalho. And our first language, our, our native language, is Portuguese. And we are from Brazil. Um, when we come here, we have no English, so IOP helped us a lot because uh, it's not easy if you come to another country and you don't know their language at all. Uh, I have almost the same history than Bianca. I came here without any English. I mean, any English. I just knew one one phrase. It was, sorry, I don't speak English <laughs> at the first time. And now, as you can see, we, are, we both are speaking English. It's not that perfect, but it's still English. Everybody, I mean, almost everyone can understand us. So if you have a basic English, gonna be so much easier. Easier, yeah, but if you have if, like a base. If you don't have anything, so gonna you be, can go it's through. possible. <laughs> it's possible to learn English. I mean, like IOP. <laughs> It's yeah. a good place and to talk learn to English. people. But never, ever, ever be afraid. Our teachers, they give a lot of attention for us, and they care about us. They ask how we are going, we are going, and we have a lot of different activities to to do. We never get bored, or they are always trying to do something new and. Uh, related with your country, your culture, and make you feel comfortable with the with where we are. And, and also, another thing that I really like in IOP, I can say not about just the professors. Uh, every single member of IOP, even coordinators, advisors, everyone, they really care about you. They really, really care. If you have a problem. Don't worry, go talk to them. They will help you anyway. And my advice for who is gonna take IOP classes is really pay attention on what the professors they say. It's always good for you and also for your classmates or professor. Uh, you do your homework. Take it really serious, and also it's not enough if you. I mean, it's enough if you want uh, pay attention in class, do your homework, but also take a time and study by yourself. It's gonna help you a lot. If you have, uh, for example, you like reading, uh, just take a book from the IOP library and read this book at home, just by yourself. Just choose something that you are gonna like, you are gonna enjoy it. One advice I can give for new students it's that you don't be afraid of making mistakes because when you are learning another language you're gonna make mistakes all the time and don't be afraid don't be ashamed now uh, about our now we are regular students yeah. in ISU and I would like to talk about our teachers well we have one teacher <laughs> and uh, they they are well prepared like they really know what they are doing and we feel like really comfortable to ask and like we come from IOP so we had no English before and now we can really take class like normal English, uh, normal American students and they really like us <laughs> I don't know <laughs> yeah. yeah another thing about Iowa State as a student now a regular student not IOP anymore is say like if you go to a class, it's so, it's like, it's so nice. You can go to a class, take a, a regular class, and feel like, oh, the professor is saying something really, really different from most of the students. Oh yeah, I can understand that. You feel so, so accomplished. Like, it's amazing. You, you have that, that experience.